Hey everybody, it's Gals and Grace, and we are so excited that you're here with us today. We are going to be cleaning today. We are cleaning my kitchen, dining room, and living room in preparation for Christmas decorating. But that's not all. We just got our new Grove shipment in with the new Mrs. Myers Christmas scents, which Yum. makes it even more fun to clean with. And we will also be using the Method Almond Wood Cleaner. Come clean with us! Gals in God's grace. Good morning, Trish. You are videotaping me. Thank you so much for coming over today Absolutely. and helping me with my mess of a kitchen. Anything for you, Amber. Um, and my dining room and my living room. Absolutely. It's my honor. So it's actually, it's got a lot of stuff around, laying around. It's not too messy. We had our Thanksgiving last night at our house and I cleaned up after dinner last night, but we already have a sink full of dishes. And we have coffee, I made Trish, and a dirty floor, because I have a dog that sheds, and stuff all over the place. So, we're going to start with the kitchen, and then we'll get on to the other rooms. Are we ready? Oh, there's my daughter. This is magnificent, Kyra. She's like, you could have like told me to get dressed or like look nice. <laughs> no, 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 you're part of the mess we're gonna clean up. Oh. <laughs> She really, really loves Kyra. That sounded I bad, but she absolutely loves her. I love her. She just did a rope braid in my hair, and I think she's sensational. She's my little poopster poopster. Okay. You guys ready? We're ready. Okay, let's, let's clean. And away we go. Trish is doing some pre-vacuuming because it was really messy. And there I am doing some dishes. I just got a new dishwasher. I am so excited about it. I get to just rinse off the dishes and put the dishes away. It's been about seven years since I've had a dishwasher, and I can't believe how much time I'm saving. That's awesome, and it's so beautiful. Look at that shine. Thanks, Trish. <laughs> so I'm just uh, cleaning some stuff up on the counter. And since I had turkey the night before, I'm getting the wishbone ready for Trish and I to make a wish. Here we go. Make wish. Um... Boom. One, two, three. I knew it. <laughs> it has to be dry. Amber, you're not pulling. Oh. <laughs> that was a good thing I didn't actually make a wish. Because <laughs> I would have lost big time. Oh, that's okay. Because I made a wish for both of us. So. Oh, perfect. Yeah, so there you go. Perfect. No negativity. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> okay. I'm using Mrs. Myers. Iowa pine scent. And I actually didn't think that I would like that pine, but it actually smells really good. Just making sure that I'm getting all surfaces as well and behind different items that are on the counter. Amber. I love your little holder thing in the jugger. It's pretty. Oh, it's hearth in hand. Joanna Gaines. Really? Yeah. It's very pretty. Thank you. I'm not going to pull that out, but technically that would be the right thing to do. But sometimes you have to do the wrong thing. Today it's going to be the wrong thing. <laughs> and now I'm on to the stove. Hey Trish, thanks for cleaning my stove. And now we're going to use Method Heavy Duty Degreaser. Amber's really grateful that I'm cleaning her stove, and she should be, because it's definitely not one of my favorite chores. Oh, Trish, I feel so blessed. You should be, because for you, I would do anything, Amber. I know you would. She is the most giving friend. She really is. And Amber is the most positive. But really, I'm just totally <laughs> envying her stove, because it's so beautiful and brand new. It is really nice. And now I'm just cleaning out the sink with the Mrs. Myers Iowa Pine. I love the scent. My sink is pretty old and beat up and chipped, but I just got new appliances, so one step at a time. For now, the sink does what it's supposed to do. I'm able to do my dishes, and I'm grateful for having a sink that works. It's not leaking, and I'm just making sure it's getting all clean. Oh, you are so positive. Wait, I, I learned it from you. Oh, okay, well, and you have a beautiful sink, too. Thank you. Well, no, 
No, I don't have a beautiful sink, but that's okay. I'm still grateful. <laughs> of course, we have to light the candle on the stove and add a beautiful little towel. And voila, so pretty. A final vacuum, and yep. we are done with the kitchen. Oh my gosh, it turned out so nice, and it was fun, even though I had to do the stove and Amber got to do the dishes, which I don't mind doing the dishes as much. Yeah, I don't really <laughs> either. I kind of like it. It feels so good, though, to have everything nice and clean and... Oh my gosh, it smells great because the Meyer products are absolutely amazing. All and, Christmassy. And of course the shark vacuum just makes it like so incredibly easy. A fresh mop and we're done. And you guys, I am so sorry that I thought I was recording the finished clean kitchen and I wasn't. I recorded before and I recorded after. So here's a picture for you. It's not perfect, but you get the idea. I think it's beautiful. The kitchen done we're moving on to the dining room we're just clearing off all the surfaces the table and the sideboard it's actually an old dresser of my mom's we're just clearing everything off so that we can get it cleaned up we're going to use the method wood for good clean even though the surfaces are painted I don't know can you use that on wood absolutely or on can. painted surfaces I believe it well it's yeah absolutely we did anyway right and it worked great now I'm doing her, uh, well, I sprayed her kitchen table. Amber's cleaning it. I'm doing the sideboard. And we are getting to get this place shining. We got to move the chairs out and get the rug cleaned. Those rugs are not real rugs. They are carpet remnants that I bought super cheap at a carpet outlet store. They were like $12, I think, for That's that so rug thrifty, there. Amber. So it's not the prettiest, but it is economical it works. it works yep it's efficient and it feels good to just be able to get all the little details pull everything out just make sure that everything is wiped down um it just looks good it smells amazing and amber is going to have a nicely fresh clean house oh right there those the little corner. goodies those were trisha's my order from meth. grove yep my little grove uh goodies i'm so excited about oh hey grove goodies now i'm cleaning the sliding glass uh window so I can see Coco and be reminded of how he ate my rabbit. <laughs> that sounds actually really, um, uh, uh, what is it, unhumanitarian? Is that right? I don't know. Trish, is it weird that I keep party favors up on the window? Absolutely not. I really like those, so it's, I keep them hanging there. It's from Kyra's engagement party. I think it's awesome. They add a little joy in my life. That's and there's, right. There's oh, the dining room. Look how done. amazing it looks. I love it. Now off to the living room. This is the before. The pillows are in a little bit of disarray. The dog bed is in the living room. It He sheds so much, and Trish is using her vacuum to get that all cleaned up. And now we're just going to dust the shelf in the corner with the, what is it? The Method. method. It's like a, a polish, wood yeah, polish. It's, like a, it's a clean and polish, right? Was it the one? I don't know what it is. You know what? Maybe we're using all of the cleaning products all wrong, but who cares? But it smells good and absolutely. We're getting and pulling the dust off. everything out. We just want to make sure that we don't miss anything. We're just doing a nice thorough clean and putting everything back in preparation for our next video where we're going to be decorating Amber's house for Christmas. That's going to be really exciting. Trish is doing so much work in my house. I feel so blessed. This oh. is an old stereo that is from the 70s. It was my mom's, and I just have it behind my couch as like a, what do you call that? Couch table? Kind of, yeah. It's behind. It's, it's perfect because it um, is placed perfectly so you can put your lamps, which accentuate your couch. It just kind of all flows together nice. And I'm using that. <clears throat> well, I use the wood for good clean, and then I use the polish later, which I don't show because it's pretty repetitive. And then I'm just using a damp cloth to clean the TV, and I'll use that also to clean the computer screen. Oh my gosh, Amber, you are doing a fantastic job on your own house, and I can't wait for you to do that fantastic job on mine. Oh, look at her. She's pulling out a bag of no. chocolates, which she knows is one of my weakest decisions. They were actually hidden from me, and I found them. Ha <laughs> ha. And she has to eat it in front of me. I'm really trying to be extra careful about that. Sorry, Trish. Yeah. Okay, so here we go. We are vacuuming the couch, just making sure every little last surface is taken care of and cleaned. But I'm just getting all the dog hair and using the little brush attachment that goes to the shark back, which I love. It's just, everything is just super easy to use. You just put it back in its little spot and you can go right to the next attachment or to oh, the Oh, this is Kyra's favorite part. 
when you karate chop the pillows. Oh, that's right. Karate. Sometimes I karate chop them, sometimes I just kind of fluff them, but I like to use the down because it just gives it a nice full look and you can uh, shape them how you want. And so, but look at me cleaning your nice couches. Yes, Amber. you are. What a blessing you are to oh, me. Oh, and you are a blessing to me because you are going to bless me next weekend. I really enjoyed watching you do this. It's kind of nice <laughs> sitting behind the camera watching your friend clean your house. <laughs> well, what a stinker. Wait, I said she was a bless. She's a stinker. That's a blessing. There you go. So just uh, putting it all together and doing a vacuum just to make sure that everything is finished and looks amazing. And I just love this part. Watch when you create okay. those lines in the carpet. Oh, yes. What I, is it about that? There's something about that. I just like it's soothing. Oh. It just it it has a finished look, and I love that. I'm I but I'm kind of anal about that because sometimes the lines don't work perfect, and then I'll go back over and do them again. So here it is, all done. Oh, that looks so beautiful. And Amber, your house is so pretty and decorated, and Thank you feel you. the love in your home. Oh, like on that pillow, right? <laughs> So I hope this encourages you to clean yours and get it all ready for the Christmas season. We're do you excited. guys do this before you decorate for Christmas? Do you like to get it all fresh and clean first or do you just like to get straight into it? Let us know in the comments. Absolutely. Oh, that pillow I got at Costco. It was $12, I think. That's really cute. One, like yeah, the, the, fur, the furry, furry pillow. One. And your branches and your beautiful vase. It just all pulls together so nicely. And that wraps it up. Another clean for the books, or for the video, or for the YouTube. It was another good clean. And we're finishing it up with a really great bottle of wine. I got it at Trader Joe's for $10.99. It's a Noble 337-2015 cab. Yeah, it's really good. We actually have repurchased this one a few times. We really like it. Yes. Make sure that you hit subscribe and ring that bell so that you get the notification for next week's video, which is going to be a decorate for Christmas. You don't want to miss it, so stay tuned. Cheers!